Hey guys and welcome to this tutorial. Today we work uh, on our open world series. So go ahead and open up your open world project. Then load up the main map and here the signal. Let's delete him so we have no reference again to him. And also let's see delete here the female so we make it a bit cleaner here. Now we can save everything up. Um, let's go back to the character map and here also everything is perfectly uh, cleared. So now let's sort here our folders, go to the content and make a new folder called GTA. We go and let's move here our vehicle blueprint folder and our normal vehicle folder. <coughs> so now you can see this folder is still there. So to actually get this uh, deleted, just click on it and delete here and just do it again. Can't delete it. And let's delete here the folder structure. So we see here is an arrow in this tutorial folder. So we can't really delete this, so just close this project up. Open up here the content folder and open the content. And let's see, here is our vehicle blueprint. And we have here something we can't see in the launcher, so it's you know, outdated or something. So we can manually delete it here. So just delete this. And now close this up and open up your project. And here we are. So now it everything is here in this folder. So we have some more structure here. So the thing we want to do today is uh, give our characters some uh, walk animations because if we hit your female and start the game we have no actual walk animation. So for this let's go into the MP character folder and open up the mail. Here a bit and uh, let's get some Mixamo animations. So open up Mixamo, go to store and <coughs> let's search for a walk animation. You can also walk mail, I think. With a comma here. No. Let's just search for walk. Once it's finished with loading, you can yeah just click here on on animation and yeah search for the one that fits perfect to your character. So I will just stay with this swagger walk, I think, and I change the character to the male one. So here it is loading very very long so I will just add this to my asset and view the download and here yeah, it's on mail and we want to make sure it's in place and now I just download this as FBX without the skin and we queue the download so let's click here on download Download it, yeah, on the desktop is okay. So get into your character uh, folder again and let's create a new folder with animation. Let's bring in the idle and oh, let's actually make another folder with material. So grab all those green materials here and move them into the material folder. So we have a bit more space here. Next up we go into the animation folder and we want to import now our uh, walking place animation. So we search for our male Mixamo skeleton and we import all here. So let's see this. Yep, looks good so far. But why is my Mm. Settings so low. Let's see, let's make this epic here. <coughs> okay, now, yeah. Oh, it's better. Okay, um, actually, t 
to go on we need to open up our animation blueprint now and go to the event graph and here we need to get some stuff so first we check if this one is valid if it's valid we want to get this velocity of this um, character and we want to get the vector length so we actually get the max walk speed and the current current speed so we return this to a variable called speed and we do this if it's valid so compile and save this so now um, we actually don't want to use just the animation we want to use an animation uh, blue, uh, plan space so we will use here the 1D so we will first work with a one dimensional direction walk and run and later we will maybe go with sidewalks and so on so let's call this idle walk okay this is not going so just like this we open this up and here we are with the new um, yeah blend space UI so to actually work here with the UI or the settings here just open up our horizontal axis uh, structure and we call this one speed and we make our maximum axis value I don't know if we should use 600 or let's check our characters uh, speed so get the character selection oh no this is the wrong the main character one and under max walk speed we have 600 selected so let's just use here 600 and let's see the number of grid um, let's actually say we make this 6 here and yeah that's it so here we have This is our preview value where we have the actual preview of this animation so we just leave it in the middle here and let's get our idle which is at zero and our walking can make it at 100 I think so let's make the preview somewhere here and let's get a run animation open up the Mixamo website here go to store and let's type in run and let's look for a, a quite smooth run this one is okay I think running with intention let's just add this and see later if it fits or not so we are adding this to our asset let's add. and now we can click here on view download click on it now we have to select it, make sure you click here on in, in place and let's queue the download without the skin and the same here, click on download save this and let's get to our character map uh, tutorial project here get back into the animation folder and let's import here our running in place with the male Mixamo skeleton and click on import all let's save this and now we can open up our 2D idle walk run and we can actually make here our run at the end on 600 but I think 600 is a bit too much maybe let's just see how this looks so to actually test this we go here into the mail and blueprint again into the animation graph and here we just delete this and we want to have a default state machine so I'm going to state machine add new state machine this will be our default connect this together inside this one we can connect some animations so let's do this add a state this will be idle walk run and here we get our blend space and connect this now to actually scale through the blend space we have here our speed variable 
and we connect this and now we can compile and save and I think we're ready to test this so I'll grab here the main one and start the game press K and now it's actually working so yeah I think this is a bit too fast let's let's actually test this by just mm, going to the main character and setting here the max speed to 400 maybe or maybe we will uh, change this value later with uh, skills or something so we have now this value of 400 I think this is okay or is it too slow let's um make the animation better here so this fits so click here on 400 now we can also look for the correct animation so maybe we can actually add a sprint to the run so we um, make this our actual move like 375 or no let's say 600 and we move here our um, running to 500 here to this value and we make here our character movement max speed to um, 400 so like it is or let's say we make this <coughs> to 100 so he's walking and on left shift press we want to set the max walk speed to 400 and on release we set this back to 100 and later maybe we do something like um let's say if we have full uh yeah so just forget what i said um we will just leave it as it is here with 400 we have the run value 100 is our walk value and 600 will be our sprint value which we will um yeah actually do later so uh, the sprint will be on maybe key press c we will uh, switch from actually just running to sprinting but when we are sprinting we will lose our stamina faster or something like this so we will implement this later when we have our stamina system so at this time we will just leave it as um this so we're walking here and now if i press shift you can sprint and i noticed uh, some um yeah ugly things here on the mail here his elbows are a bit too yeah too fat or too mus too muscle heavy um you can see this here in the walk animation yeah, they are just a bit too massive so to change this you can open up um, your MB lab and make this here a bit smaller or to make it a bit smoother you can move here the elbow a bit more to the right and here a bit more to the left and yeah re-rig this everything and reload all the animations but it's up to you I will leave it as it is and yeah we will continue in the next episodes with head rotation health system XP system and so on so we have finished with this mail here um, you, if you like you can do everything we done for the male also for the female I will not show this but I will have this done in the next video and we can yeah, look into it yeah that's all thank you for watching and have a nice day bye